Hello guys, in this video I am just going to unbox and also do a sound test for the Infinity Fuse 100 portable Bluetooth speaker. So I got it hands on 4 days before of the first one and I later received the second one so that I can pair both of them and have a sound test and also with the solo performance also. So here is the box directly from the Amazon and also get the sealed package itself. So just want to remove the seal. So the price noted here is 3000 rupees but for 3400 rupees you can get the infinity fuse 100 itself. It's be better to buy both of them because it has the dual pairing stereo mode also and also the sound is fabulous from the solo performance so I also expect the same from the dual performance also. So opening the package we got all the brands that are from Harman Kardon. So JBL also one of them, AKG from Samsung everything is also. With the same movie so we got a strap so i don't think so this is much useful so better useful for some other purpose and here we got a micro usb cable to the type a1 and some plastic holders and finally a small user node how to use this properly so that's it and the pack box packaging itself here is the speaker, so exactly the same one here. So now let's actually do a sound test of the speaker. Before that I just make a physical overview and you can see here is the four buttons and which one of them has the inbuilt two LED. So here you can see the two LEDs, one is the white one and the red one. Red one will be blinking when the battery is low as well as when the uh, device is getting being charged. And here we get is the Connected. micro USB port and an auxiliary port. I think you could see this. So and also it's a very tight packing one. And this is also an IPX7 water resistant. So you can just use it in your bathroom or even during raining, a mild raining or something. But don't you uh, put this in the swimming pool for just testing purpose because we can't assure such a safety on this. We got the microphone over here and the uh, great Infinity logo. From comparing other brands, the logo is uh, looking much more good quality and seems really great. And also we got the brighter enclosure for the speaker. We got a single 4.5 watt speaker and also a base radiator over the side. See the white uh, Infinity logo is glowing as this device is connected with my smartphone. So now let's do a uh, sound test with dual pairing as well as a solo performance.
groups is really insane. So I think you also got a better experience if you use the headphones. And also, I just want to give you a, a bit suggestion. So that is, if you are using these speakers or even your headphones, if you are new to a smartphone or something, anyway, please tweak some settings for the sound quality and effects if you are a Samsung user or if you are any other Chinese brand user or anything, just go and search for sound effects and something. Get into the equalizer, just tweak some settings like this. Because having it in a normal mode, it will not be a good effect from your Bluetooth speaker. Any brand Bluetooth speaker, any kind of quality, it is any cost. The Infinity has in integrated bass mode and normal mode tweaking. Just press the minus and plus button. Normal. So it's normal now. Press them again. Deep bass. And you get the deep bass mode. But this is not actually enough. So you have to go and tweak in some settings like this. So this setup is really insane for ba bass lovers. If you are getting jazz like this means you will be getting a great audio rather than the normal one. So you can use normal when you are using the Bluetooth setup with your home theater system or in your car installed with subwoofer. If you are using a Bluetooth speaker with a full range speaker alone then just tweak some settings to get some deeper bass. So this is a suggestion for you so that you won't miss any quality. Even if you are using headphones please don't forget to tweak in the settings. You will be getting an insane level of audio quality and immersive bass if you are tweaking those settings. So thanks for watching guys, just uh, I will put the link in the description, it is better to buy both of them in a combo pack, I didn't see any combo pack from Amazon site so you can just put the put in the card with the both of them, if you just want a single piece also you can also go for that but I would recommend dual one because the stereo, stereo sound effect is really insane and I am really immerse, uh, getting an immersive feel from hearing them and I am really impressed with the audio quality but not for audio files. So if you are uh, just a, a music lover and want some deeper bass sound, just go for this. But not the uh, quality and the loudness that you can, you can expect from other JBL speakers that are priced above 7000 or something. For this price, you are getting a really uh, great sound. Just put on some packs and buy for both of them so you can get the immersive sound effects. If you get the single one also, you will get the same level of audio level but still some kind of uh, low in bass or something. But you won't get immersive sound. You bought uh, both of them just keep it in your desk like this or just uh, from a distance of uh, below 5 feet you can get really an immersive surround effects while watching movies or uh, Netflix or something from your smartphone or even from your laptop. You can also use your laptop with the auxiliary port but I don't think so through aux you can't use the uh, uh, dual stereo parrot. Uh, so you can just use the bluetooth even most of the laptops are coming with bluetooth functionality also. For, so thanks for watching guys subscribe my channel if you are new to this channel so that you can get regular updates from here and thanks for watching goodbye.